item number, SCP-5801, Object Class, Safe, Special Containment Procedures, SCP-501 has been acquired by the Foundation and is designated as private property. Any civilians who reach SCP-5801's designated red zone are to be amnesticized and relocated by posted guards. All testing and interviews involving SCP-5801-1 instances are to take place outside of the barrier surrounding SCP-5801. Description SCP-5801 is in an undisclosed location in Nome, Alaska. A barrier composed of an unknown transparent material surrounds SCP-5801. The barrier is 7 meters in height and encloses an area that is 22.4 meters in diameter. Both instances of SCP-5801 Dash one, and personnel are unable to pass through the barrier. SCP-5801 contains instances of SCP-5801-1, which are sapient beings composed out of free spherical masses of snow and possess tree branches in the place of limbs. Materials making up the facial features of SCP-5801-1 vary, but recorded materials include sticks, leaves, berries, vegetables, and rocks. SCP-5801-1 instances possess the ability to speak and move, and have been observed to converse with each other on a regular basis. According to interviews with multiple SCP-5801-1 instances, SCP-5801 is an afterlife for deceased individuals whose effigies were shaped into SCP-5801-1 through a ritualistic process. Due to the absence of new SCP-5801-1 instances, it is assumed that this process no longer occurs. Addendum 5801-01 Interview Log The following is an interview with an instance of SCP-5801 Dash one, referred to as SCP-5801-1-A. Dash 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 the interview was conducted by researcher Morrissey. SCP-5801-1-A. Dash 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 waddles close to the barrier. SCP-5801-1-A. Dash 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 Bear's facial features composed completely out of blueberries and stands approximately 1.8 meters tall. Researcher Morrissey stands on the other side of the barrier. Hey, uh, excuse me? Pardon? Hi, my name is Morrissey. I'm a researcher working for the SCP Foundation. You probably see our team around here often. I was wondering if I could ask you a few questions if you're not busy. Why, yes, of course. Ain't a lot to keep me busy here anyways. All right, then. Can I get your first name, please? Yeah, uh, it's Pete. Okay, Pete, do you recall your life before you came here? Thankfully, yes. <laughs> Why, I was a farmer. I had my own little dairy company 
good little farm I had there. It was a family business, too. Was the person who brought you here in your family? Sadly, I don't think I'm allowed to say. And why is that? They know y'all monitoring this place, and they told me they'd send me to the frosted abyss. Oh, if I told y'all who they were, what that means, hell if I know. Huh. All right, then. Perhaps you can tell me about the ritual that sent you here. Well, I didn't hear about no punishment about telling y'all about this ritual. So I guess I can give you what I remember. On my deathbed, they told me to declare that I am truly afraid of death and wish to be frozen in this life or something along those lines. Then they said some mystical mumbo jumbo out of some spell book. And then they told me that my body would be buried in a mound of snow. It was to preserve my essence in ice, or something like that. Are you actually afraid of death? Without question, my friend. Without question. I don't really believe in no God, so I had no hope in an afterlife. I thought death would be the end of my consciousness and feeling. I was so scared until they showed up. All right, all right. Thank you for your time. Hey, any time, my friend. Again, there ain't not much to do around here, so this time was well spent. Addendum 5801-02. Interview Log 2. The following is an interview with an instance of SCP Dash 5801 dash 1, referred to as SCP 5801 dash 1 dash B. The interview was conducted by researcher Morrissey. SCP 5801 dash 1 dash B is close to the barrier. SCP 5801 Dash one dash B bears two rocks for eyes, a carrot for a nose, and a mouth made from blueberries. SCP dash five eight oh one dash one dash B stands approximately one point two meters tall. Hey, you there, the little guy. <laughs> Why, yes, I am. Cool. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering if I could ask you some questions. Sure. Will it really help if you science stuff? Why, yes, it will. Yay, I'm ready. All righty then. What is your name? I'm Timothy, but you can call me Timmy. Awesome. Well, Timmy, I was wondering how you got to this place. Well, I had a thing called a brain tumor, and Mommy and Daddy didn't want me to die. So they took me to the people called the... No! I'm sorry! I didn't mean to tell them! I did it! No, please! Mommy!